It was not as long as I thought. But it's fine. So, um, so many outsiders all of a sudden brings many outsiders ideas. A good challenge upon us. Where can we find Basaltius? This is the second time someone has asked me about Basaltius today. What would someone want with that creature? <coughs> I can tell you what <coughs> I told her when she asked me for the information. No, don't look at me like that. Alright, I'll tell you where it is, but, um, that is all. You need to know how to summon it, uh, see. There's a cave southwest of here. It's there. No more questions. Besides, I don't think anyone else knows of it, but perhaps, uh, Mulder it? Mulder? Hello, question. Hello, outsider. Welcome to uh, Freywald. What do you know of the Basaltius? Are all outsiders so persistent? You're the second one to interrupt my tasks. I should not tell you anything, but if it will keep you off my uh, beard wires, I heard the Basaltius can be lured uh, by violating the elemental balance around its den. There are four standing stones that act as seals. It will not say. I will not say more than that. But you may. Um, but may your path never lead where it treads. Turn back and do not um, ex execute this endeavor to find it. Oh, I was already zoomed out. Weapon cash. You're gonna teach the farmers how to fight? Ha, huh, good luck with that. Is that a cannon penis? Don't you think the legacy will be left behind? Ha, huh, not me, I'm gonna live forever. Communication in. Uh, all this doom and gloom sorry. about the earth and all Hello. shutting down, not me. I'm gonna find a way to stop, um, to stay operating if it's the last thing I do. Which I guess would be, um, would be if I can't figure out. Spend the farmer situation and offer perils as a reward. Let's commit our meeting to memory. Ha, ah, genius. A short eating perils will keep me from shutting down. Welcome, Outlander. Each of us will eventually shut down one way or another. What matters is that we leave, what we leave behind afterwards. As for me, I'm com um, compelling a collection of interesting items. From whom, eh, for whom comes after me. Explain the sword situation and the perils. A rare peril would be a perfect addition to my collection. Uh, probably not even in this. It's probably on top because it doesn't seem to be there. Shoot you in the floor. What is my purpose? Speak freely. No directive needed. If all things end, what's the point of today? Why should I take action at all? Explain the farmer's situation and give Pearl as reward. Pearl as reward. A pearl? Why are they valued so? Perhaps I should find out. Oh, okay. So we could have actually gotten the roof from inside the building. This building was just a different shape than most. Guess I should hand in her thing. Well, yeah, of course there's going to be druid bots. Hey there. You got them to talk to you. Amazing. That's more information than I thought they had. See you around. So, they all uh, gave us the location and grappled riddles. But I guess we know where to start. I can picture it now. Once I have the Bassasaltius' knowledge, I will have the nobles and merchants lining up outside my house. No, my mansion. The oven didn't, uh, did say southwest, right? I'll find a cave and meet you there quickly now. See you later. 
I can't wait. Soon everyone will know my name and reputation. I'll meet you there. I saw fume. Do you have a the Gorlocks are not <coughs> to be underestimated. I have found um fought them before, uh, but none so organized as this tribe. We must remain focused. We oh, read that. Wish to speak Good work. I'm glad that you were able to recruit so many fires. It is worse than I expected, and we will need everyone we have. Resuming work cycle. You have all your assignments. Move out. The, the pearls that these farmers harvest path. are the only source of uh, livelihood. Some of the urban even look at pearl farmers as a primary resource for existence. The Gorlock continue to pill for pearls at every opportunity. As you eliminate the Gorlocks, search them for stolen pearls. Let us recover as many as we can. We will continue speaking later. Most of the farmers are already out in the fields defending their position. I have trained them as best as I can, give them, uh, I could give the circumstances, but they're still wor uh, wielding farm tools. I'm going to need you to distribute the weapons you gathered uh, to those on the front line. While I may not mar um, markably improve their combat abilities, at least it will boost their com uh, confidence. And, the, uh, and they are not alone in this fight, and prove that they are not alone in this fight. Order. Why can't I just take the perils which are just there, lying around? <laughs> so, you want to eat the pearls to live longer? As you can? That's right. Why would you um, just give your um, yourself away if you can extend your lifespan? The end is coming sooner or later. Well, if it ever comes to that, I would much rather give her the pearls to extend her life, not mine. I need to get A peril. A pleasant, pretty pearl covered in gross uh, gorlock guts. I need a target. Now, I kind of prefer my back, which I currently have, because it does has its effect. But why the farm pearls at all? There seems uh, there'll be no one left to enjoy them. We do not value the pearls as much as the process of farming. We work together and spend time with each other uh, towards a common goal. It is our enjoyment that enriches of of today that values not tomorrow. Well, if the pearl, if you just do it for fun, why don't you just let the things have the pearls? Like if you don't actually want need them. You might as well just let the Gorlocks have them if you just want to do it for fun, interactive gameplay. Hmm, 
this is annoying. The amount of Gorlocks we need to kill is... I have noticed that some of, like, these gather quests are, like, levels of, like, vanilla WoW. Where, like, you kill shit and it just doesn't give you any fucking progress. I was just being unlucky, it's actually it's actually okay drop rates. I need to target something first. And then I proceed to get unlucky again. It's too far away. Try glimmer pools. <sighs> like, it barely even minded them recently, fuck's sake. Like, this might give us the thing that we need. Because it wasn't called like a glimmer trout, so I think that glimmer pool might work. How many glimmer trout did we need though? We needed like, I think we only need one trout. Might as well get more though, just in case. Might as well get five, just to be safe. Since we have like two pools of them. And then we just need to get still. Crystalline sturgeon. He is a sturgeon. I guess we're gonna just throw these two fish in. Since they seem to be the same. Are they used in any cooking recipes? I don't know. Maybe I'll just sell the fish instead. Like the, um, the perception fish. Not that. Ooh, shit. Gives a lot of fishing level. I guess they're getting... Oh wait, no, it, it's only for a short amount of time, though. So it's useless. Hopefully we don't need five of these. To be close to it, or do, do we just get to keep the buff? Yeah, nope, we can just keep the buff.
Ancient to trade needs to be at least useless. two centuries old. Useless. Useless. Kind of okay. Useless. Oh yeah, we actually needed the pike for the thing though, so we don't want to sell that. For some reason it does sell for a lot though. If you find anything exotic, bring it to me. Never gonna use that, so I'll just sell it. Actually, maybe I can sell. No, it's soul bound on the auction house. I had that. Fine, leave. I was done talking to you anyway. Useless. Wait, what's this? Sells for a lot, so kind of useless. You know, that means fish. I guess we should throw this just so that you so we get the recipe. If you find anything exotic, bring it to me. Come back with some better stories. Not really very useful. If you find anything exotic, bring it to me. Is this soul bound? No. Not everything in the ocean is as good looking but it's useless. Nice as I Let's just use on the new ring that we got. Just so it isn't wasting backspace.
too far away. I need a target. Like, feel, it does feel kind of shit that, like, the only ability that I have which seems to actually deal damage is the new fucking ability that they added. Like, it feels like all my moves do fucking nothing except that, except that one ability. It's too far away. Collecting items. Yeah, I enjoy it so I can leave something of myself. Perhaps one day someone else will find the treasure in them. In the same way, I can give life on. All the efforts must be focused on restoring the machine and sustaining us. Anything else is a wasted effort. Take that, Gorlox. We're winning. Of course we are. Speak. Winning! <laughs> The fathers have acquitted themselves well. I'm proud to fight alongside them. However, it's not over yet. Return, <coughs> Return the pearls to the farmers or suffer their wrath. Thank God, I can't eliminate the Gorlocks threat was just one of the objectives here. Given the farmers their life back, eh, back is another. Excellent. As long as we fight together and for each other, I believe that we can be victorious. We will continue speaking later. It seems that the Gorlocks have been bolstering their defenses, hurry, curse you, with some elementals. This explains how they were able to overrun the farmer so easily. It will take all of us strength to hold off the colossal um, already in the field. I need you to stop new elementals from being created. Elementals of this size and power can only be created by the most powerful of Gorlock shamans. Seek them out behind enemy lines and eliminate them. This should end the Gorlock threat for the farmers once and for all. Resuming work sign. With me, my friends, I ask that you follow me one last time into one last battle. Charge for Agmafar. Agmafar is invincible. Invisible? Then how do we know where she is? Stargazer. Stargazer. Glimmering pool. Do I just throw the fish in, t in attempts to catch a better fish? Nothing, okay, empty, like a soul. Almost missed. I don't think that the swipe hit like upwards. Ugh, cringe! Don't, don't just fucking one shot it from like half health. Fuck's sake! Now I'm stuck and able to do anything for like half an hour. Guess we have to f wait and fish all day. They whisper. This thief could kill it in instantly because they're a thief. They're a vile creature. They're not even human, they're that vile. 
They did not kill instantly. Except that they did. When it gets to half health for some reason, Warlock seems to be able to just instantly kill mobs. That just sounds like the Daralan experience. As I've said, it's a lag central. It's the center of all lag. Agro, she gave everything for us. But how could she fall? Another interruption. Because she's a filthy casual. Thank you for your aid, stranger. Without you, none of this would have been possible. You've given us back our livelihood today, and our hope. Take this as a small token of our gratitude. It's not enough, but it's all we can offer. Know that you'll always be welcome AMONG our people. Let us uh, now turn our attention to Agruf. Our lives are our own. We had no one to turn to. Agruf chose to help us. Not out of reward or obligation, but simply a sense uh, of duty to a fellow Irvin. As we fought the colossal Gorlock, we attempted to uh, attempted to flank us with no one available. Agro split off alone to intercept them. Uh, though vastly outnumbered, Agraf held the line and defended uh, these fo defeat these foes before you. But her injuries were too grave, and she succumbed to her wounds. Even in death, she refused to fall. Agraf has made an impact on all of us. She shall live on in our minds and memories. She will be remembered. She will be remembered. She got shut down. Emergency shutdown procedure. Broken ass leg. Nah, not leg. Foot. Stings like a bitch. Are we ever going to get sent to the dungeons, though? Glimmer pool, stargazer, glimmer, glimmer, stargazer. Jesus Christ, the pike pool is... I think the pike pool might actually be extremely rare. What took so long? The raging elementals could have killed me. I mean, lucky they didn't see me, but uh, you could have gotten here a bit faster. She lets out an only side. Let us know when you're ready to enter the cave. Have After you. One. Come on, let's go. She's gonna die. She's super annoying. Look at this place. Are those the standing stones? You need something? Look at the walls of the caves. Look at all the gems. I can barely believe it. The stories are real. I'm going to be so rich and influential and powerful. I need to sit down for a moment and catch my breath. See you later. According to the Irvin, we have to lure the spirit out or disturb it or something. The four standing stones they mentioned have um, depleted elemental cores lying around them. There's a uh, injurious elemental outside on the beach to the north. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? Fish! Could it? Uh, could you get me the elemental cores? Maybe just a few. We're so close. We might as well try. See you around. The stone depicts a carving of a figure with a gem behind them. The figure's uh, unusually long arms reach uh, for more gems. The standing stone depicts a carving of a figure with large eyes that look at the la uh, rock-like creature. The creature has gems embedded into it around them. The standing stone depicts a carving of a figure surrounded by mirrors. The person is adorned with many gems, more than um, they can carry, more than uh, will ever be needed, while their reflections are smiling at the person is frowning. The standing stone depicts a carving of a figure standing tall and proud, pointed at a mountain. Many kneel under this um, cover of sh their shadow.
There we are, there's a pike pool. <sighs> I should probably use my perception increaser. Wow, they didn't last very long, do they? What blood perch do? It's still recharging. Of course, we only get one because Lund X at three. I would recommend not doing that. Like, stealing my kills is a terrible thing to do. Get away, you scum. Like, I may be forced to erase their very existence. Indigenous core. A layer of sand and dust lie on the hardened earthen core. Rumor. <coughs> Room. Um. That trembles faintly in your hand. This Overwatch player does not deserve to be here. They are a player of Overwatch. Why are they even playing WoW? Like, they're not meant... They're not a player of WoW. Why are they here? They make, They play Overwatch! What the fuck are they doing? Like, what the fuck are people even doing these quests for? Like, these aren't even quests that, that, like, these aren't even main story quests. Like, what are these bastards doing over here? And he's dead. I hate the fact there's no way to get off your mount. With Dragon Riding. Like, this is gonna take hours now just because of other players. I guess we just have to do it later, probably. When there's less bastards around. Target something first. Okay, just three more elementals. Oh, fish. You know what that means? Fish. I can't use that item yet. Chit, 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 chit. Glob of Mocus. Recharging. It seems that we catch one pike in every single one of these pools. Oh, 
That's not a real fish. Why is that there? What a doom. It does nothing. Might sell for a bit though. But fish don't seem to sell very well. This Overwatch player, what the fuck are they doing here? They're, in, they're a player of the hit game Overwatch, which doesn't actually exist. Only Overwatch 2 eradicated. A Overwatch was actually destroyed. They deleted it from the from existence. They said they wouldn't, yet they did. So there's two more elementals now. I got all wrong. Hello. Do you have the have artifact? Ha 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 ha! Four calls, four standing stones, ready when you are. Safe travels. Why? Why is it bind when pick up? Make it warbound! You literally added the warbound system! Just make the shit! Which should would like make make crafting recipes fucking warbound! There is no reason why they shouldn't be warbound. I'm so close, I can feel it in my bones. Place the cause next to each standing stone. It is time to summon the bastard soldiers. First call paste. King of old, binded by pride, he thought he could rule more than just mortal subjects. Did you hear that? It must be the Basaltius. We got its attention. The curse of their uh, never-ending desire brings mortals and creatures alike to their knees. Haven't you heard? Greed is good. Your old Groot. Um, Grooch. Let's keep going. The self-consumed love for one's apprentice hides the inner gem of um, from sight. What's that even mean? Converting others' natural talents leads to stagnation and self-ruin. I didn't come here for a lecture, I just want... Oh, the bass assault you is quick out of her, just do it. I do not wish to fight you mortals. Yeah, I'm here to grant your heart's desires. What, really? Was that easy? That was easier than I thought. It's the Basaltius. What are you doing? He refuses to talk to me, though. He only wants to talk to her because she's a casual. Hello. That was almost effortless. For me, at least. Can you imagine what I could do with this knowledge? Can you imagine my name spoken in Storm and Gilneas? Maybe even Orgrimmar? I'll be able to... Um, do and achieve everything I wanted. Everyone will finally look up to me, and I'll have all the gold, and all um, and I can find and um create. See you later. I'm ready, creature. Give me your knowledge, as you wish. What's happening? No. You know the gem one must learn: humility, patience, and nurturing, like the high mountain and deep caves that harbor gems. You will remain in this form for many eons until the inner silence scream ceases and calmness of your mind guides your heart uh, to task. Only after thousands of years of a stillness will you learn the truth of, um, of a perfect gem as I do. You will wait... Um, you will wait patiently like that, like the others before you. 
Bosco's gaze falls upon you and returns to the earth. It's carved in flesh it deep and this um fresh and the stone depicts a human woman, her hands outstretched as if trying to commune with Basolius. Beside her is another figure resembling you. Why is it fucking soulbound though? There's literally no reason behind it. Just let me fucking trade it with my warbound shit. Like you added the warbound feature. Why aren't you fucking using it? Glistening or speak um streaks of ruby shine through the um primary stale rock. This rock's perfect for urban reshaping um refinement. Fungal chunk. Some more intact than others. The chunk feels uh for variety and gives slightly under the pressure. That wave definitely does a lot of damage. I should have got that first. Like it gives, so, it adds so many stacks and it deals so much damage. Like I said, it's weird though that like that is literally my only move that does damage. Like it just does so much more damage than any other move that I have. Alright, I need to use my bomb, don't I? I need to, like, say the line from that boss in Mop where he goes, Who's the bomb? Mm -hmm. Bastard. Bastard, you fucking Overwatch player. I tried to move, but it wouldn't let me. Let's hope it doesn't throw out another one. I can't attack that target. Is this the Wayne to Diplome? Bread and spore. I'm out of range. Now the spore that you heard, Lil. I don't have a target. What are we after in this cave? It's just the things at the end. Got some belongings. The site tablet carefully etched with urban writing. Chunks of stone are missing from the servant's body, and the remains are streaked with mud. Tiny pale mushrooms sprout densely all over the corpse. Large bulbous groves pursued, presumed from the servant's mouth and ears. A broken memory gem sits crushed beneath the body. This must be Modera.
Shit, I still need more belongings. Can these actually drop anything? Yes. Modern's ore bag filled with red ore that looks um exclusive to gem vine uh, tunnels. Escape, go, see the world, world, world. <laughs> I'm gonna have to go deeper probably again. Since I'm pretty sure we can only get her belongings in this cave. Oh yeah, these are actually hard to find because they look like they're dead. Alright, what this? Memory gem fragment. Dull and filled with spiderweb spiderweb crabs. The gem piece is fr um, fractured and might crumble into um, new grass. The original gem must have suffered immense physical damage. No salvage in this. How many pikes have I got now? Two. I don't think the pikes are unique to this zone though, so we should be fine. It was only the other thing that was. It was only the glimmer thing that was. <laughs> Collect as much ore as you can. These core uh, core ways uh, still my priority, but these injured uh, need immediate help. It's not much, but this all will help stabilize the core way. With Altman's help, we'll be able to reclaim the quarry and the mines and establish a supply line with Domran Ghoul. Please hurry. The Nerubian poison will deal irre irreversible damage given enough time. If it erodes enough of the frame or seeps into the memory gem, then we may not be able to save them. The you brought back more than I expected, thank you. Now we'll be able to make the polis. The last thing I expect today, uh, expected today was to see um, Belgrim much less receive his help, but I guess that since the callway was damaged, he has no choice. I do not know how um, to compute this. It is only uh, logical to accept it. She begins crushing the fungal flesh uh, roughly in the palm of her hand and quickly becomes a massive pulpy dis um, disturbably quick. Here, mix this mud and apply it to the injured. Go, this poultice can mend even our stone bodies. Belgrim, your help is appreciated. You are right. I have been remiss in fulfilling my edict. Now the Corway lies in ruin. I need your help, Edelgon. Just like you needed mine. I need Findorn and Tregor brought to the pool. A stone stalker here. The habitat resides far beneath the isle's surface. All the re recent changes must have disturbed them. Regardless, thank you for slaying it. <coughs> <coughs> They're highly territorial and kill for sport. As for the tunnel, there is areas. The area sounds beyond recovery. We'll need to let nature reclaim it. You returned. Did you find uh, Mudra? What is all that you're carrying? Mudra's notes. Oh no, cringe. I'm sorry I wasn't here earlier, Attica. Was kind enough to. What's going on? Welcome, Outlander. Her looks through the things that you retrieve one by one. So you risked your life to find our friend. Modra is gone, then. Her notes are. 
about rare ore in, from the caverns uh, melted down it becomes a beautiful glaze for pottery what can I do? I'm no fighter, I can't avenge her. Besides, her body has already uh, been reclaimed by the earth. Though it's much certain, but the state of her memory gem... Um, that much is certain from the state of her memory fragment. What can I do now but make a pot? Will you help me? Follow no directives but your own. Place this one. Um, here for smithing, smelting. While I smell this, uh, try and model the ball of clay on the table. Don't overdo it. Trust your hands. The oil has melted into a glaze. We'll now apply it. Keep doing what you're doing. And then now place the uh, into the forge for firing. Almost done. Experience. Needs just a bit more time for the fire to set. Let's see. Uh, wobbly edges. An asymmetric orientation. The glaze looks a bit too dry. Will crack. I need more uh, practice smithing this. Uh, and you are. Thank you, Arakat. I've not felt this depth of gratitude before. I'll return my, with my new pot, pottery. Condom won't let um, Modjin's efforts be in vain. Uh, anyone else? Frodo's face is massive webs, pale um, eyes peek out, but uh, blink once slowly. Carry him to the pool of eternity. This bitch empty. Yeet. Good. Now for Ebon. Through his own physical health. Wait, where'd she go? Never looks like a pale, uh, pale pile of rubble. A thinly glowing piece of mud, like Polis, is barely holding him her together. A bowler's eyes are still um do not respond to the light or movement. How's a bowler doing? Let's commit our... She's fading. I. My storm rook can take her to Dornegal. Perhaps the healers there can help. Pilgrim, thank you. He preyed on the weak. I she dead. Your Argo appraises Mo uh, Moria, Bolgren, and finally you. I thank you for... Um, it's been the longest time since I received help from Outlanders or Oathsworn. Bats! Spider bats! Chat or work. The Nubians attacking the Irvin again. We must follow the swarm. I fear that we are outnumbered, but if their Irvin uh, come together, we can stand with us. We just might have a chance. I dismiss you. Take one of the rams, Balegrim. It's no storm rook, but it's faster than going on foot. I have never ridden one, but how difficult can it? Whoa there! I'll bring the Unbound to the Corway. We'll meet you in Dornagal. I forgot, this thing has like, literally the best fucking thing because it looks so good. Like, I don't know why, but like, the... The fire became like, so much more intense after it became Dragon Riding Mount. Oh, not the mine, not the stupid bombs again. I'm not in the circle, so it should be fine. 
It looks like if we're far enough away, it doesn't hit you. Like, it usually goes fairly close to where the thing is, so as long as you cast it fairly close. Oh, there's a new quest here. Because we already picked up all the quests here. Interesting, some moss wool. Maybe. Mead, fresh mead. <coughs> List of requests I've written below. We've got more reports of Fungorium returning to places that we've um, dubbed the Fungophory. Support is needed to clear out these mushroom menaces out of the area. Avoid them spreading any further. Help wanted. Kovald's rest has become overrun by kobolds. This is one um, of the sacred resting places of the earth and must be restored. We'll do those quests fucking later. I can't be bothered to do the del the delves the same delves again. Knowing those quests won't pick up full before. These damn bugs! They're attacking our injured. That's a bug. That's a bug, as they say. They're wounded. The Nerubians are kicking the earth and when they're down. Morris suddenly points to the centre of the battlefield. There, in the middle. That's uh, Zurex. Again. And um, Amalia. Oh, the mountain strength. Be with me. We've got to, uh, to help. Um... Borrow quakes with fury. These cursed Nerubian attacking a... Um, Tredge site, so that uh, many wounded and defenseless, and yet it looks like um, you outlanders are putting up a fight. Let's grind every last one of those bugs back into the ground. Why hide? I must defend my people. Who are you? But of course, another outlander. I hope Dagger and my dad are okay. Let's go. I'm Warren, tamer of the uh, Cinder Bees and creator of Cinder Broom. He squares him up as if um, should be impressed. I brought a barrel of cinder brew to help the injured. I thought drinking it could ease their pain, but for the most it just caused uh, more burning pain. I refuse to let the brew go to waste. Maybe we can weaponize it. The Nerubians are bugs after all, organic and flammable. This burrow here is perfect test subject. Use the cinder brew to repel the Nerubian attackers. Let's pick up that cinder brew keg. I have an idea. Toss it down the hall. Ha! I knew it would work. <laughs> Let's light them up. Can only use my range attack very spare and very on very very long cooldown. This bitch empty. Oh, Illyria is what they said. She giving him the suck, the big suck. <laughs> Hold on! Help is on the line. Cover quickly. Half Nerubian forces dealt with. <laughs> Cinderbrew seems to. Oh, it seems to also apply burn to them. Let's see how strong the burn is. Yeah, it does a lot. How are you doing, Illyria? Are you going to win the big suck? I will crush you. I will crush you. 
Where is my knife? She must suffer for what she has done. The core weighs seven. You will never reach the harbinger. They really should have actually severed the core way. Because as we saw, the core way is open. I literally went down it. <laughs> Why are the mages like so fucking tanky? I need a target. I guess these ones are the actual mages. I don't have a target. Uh I probably need to kill about four more spiders. Four more Nerubian. because there's only three. No, I only took two. <sighs> it is my oath sworn duty. He covers his head. The um he's covered in head to toe with blood and ichor. Good work out. Oh. Good, eh, uh, good gruesome work. We are the bedrock. We Mountains are the fall foundation. on me. That was incredible. And to think <laughs> that we've been drinking that stuff. Returning to task. Goodbye. We know the Nerubians are in league with Zal with our Naifu Zalatev. And we've, we've, um, have a fair idea why they attacked us and Daralan. They seem bent on destroying the Irvin, even kicking them when they're down. But why? Is it because the Corway is the key to destroying it? Um, is it destroying? It's near enough. Maybe uh, what we're doing here, repairing the Corway, is just what um, they dunno want us to do. We should get back to Dorangul and try and piece this together. The three hammer. They're retreating. Your cinder brew makes for quite the weapon, Wenbrand. Meet us at the Foundation Hall, champion. The fight against the Nerubians is far from over. Well, that is everything on the surface, by looks of things. <laughs> but yeah, while we're passing this area, I should probably actually put on a work order for crafting materials. Supply of goods. Um, what is it called? Profession equipment. What want mining profession equipment. Uh, finesse. Oh god. Can we actually have it so it actually only shows the new shit? Oh, these are the high up ones, I think, though, so I, they won't be craftable. Uh, order by item level should be right, though. Oh, this is craftable by me. Do I really have to supply them, though? This kind of defeats the point, though. Like, it just kind of defeats the point, though, doesn't it? If I have to survive, supply the thing. This is why I don't like the crafting order system. What's the fucking point? 
Like, I want to put up the crafting thing, but I can't be bothered to just deal with, like... Return. And then I've still got to have, like, the crafting shit for, like, the other expansion as well. Have anything ancient to trade? Oh, this is gonna be suck. Crafting is such a fucking mistake, it never should have been changed. They're all too fucking expensive, so there's no point. different finesse levels. Should have done this one. If you find anything exotic, bring it to me. Let me guess, actually, I got tricked and one of them is not real. No, they're both real. Unless they're not. They're both Dragonfly, aren't they? Like, what the fuck? Yeah, I got tricked. Like, it's just dumb. Like, just let me fucking use the, like, crafting order system. Like, what's the point of crafting order system if it doesn't fucking work? Two centuries old. Like, now we've just literally lost money because lol, X3. If you find anything exotic, bring it to me. Like, it's too fucking hard to work out which are the actual new shit. And if I can't just use the fucking exotic, crafting order system. Like, what I is the point in the crafting order system if you can't put reasonable. a fucking order in? Like, if the game won't even let you just put a fucking order in and have, like, the person craft it, like, without needing to spend the materials, like... I could just craft it my fucking self. Like, it just defeats the entire fucking point. <coughs> I am glad you're back, Adolgan. The council is needed here in Dornagol more than ever. It is time we stand as one and strike back against the Nerubians. Like, what is the point in a personal order crafting system if you can't even fucking put in an order? Well, I'm listening. The Urban Council is reunited. Hopefully, they uh, they can put aside um and get past the call, get the call away. With Repet. Hopefully they'll help us with the Nerubians and Zalatef, Naifu. May your hammer strike through. Very good to The Unbound have you. arrived with the equipment and resources needed to begin repairing the Galway. <coughs> this is a momentous occasion, one for the Archives. I would uh, not say this to M. Um, Gun, but I see the Titan's hands in it. And now it is time for me to exercise my directive. I have devised a plan for how to organize our work most efficiently, and have also allocated supplies to, um, to welcome them. Take this order to Agandrum's workers and see that they are begin the, uh, in earnest. We'll meet you shortly. Con Adelgarn and I will oversee the repairs. This will be no small task. What is your query?
bound workers. I can't believe the co uh, council ward still had the Corway schematics. Astonishing. It's too late to go get a good. Is it too late to go get a good hammer? I've been itching to build. Let's get these gears moving again. Are these numbers right? I guess that the circuitry is that delicate. Is it too late to get a good hammer? Repairs will be wasted if we're attacked again. We need to bolster our defenses. Hurry, curse you. <laughs> the edict must be followed. Even with this many workers, the callway repair will take time. We'll need to delegate what we do in the meantime. Go where the edicts lead. Everyone is still on top. We of protect the people. I know the unbound are. can repair and unblock the callway exponentially, but. I also know the Nerubian. If they see any opportunity for an ambush, they'll take it. With our backs turned and our forces on the corway, we're prime targets. I need uh, to rally my storm riders and form a perimeter around Dorangul in case of an attack from within or without. Meet me outside the storm perch. I will call upon my troops there. Be vigilant. Meet me outside the storm perch. We will rally the storm riders. And protect the unbound. The Hog Riders. Oh, yeah, I still need to use that fucking bomb. And I guess while we're here, I can <coughs> do the thing. Over here, we will fly to the rookery together. Once the storm riders are gathered, we can form a perimeter around the corway to protect the workers. The Nerubians will catch us unaware. Won't catch us unaware the second time. Let me know when you're ready. Okay, so it has to be a follower dungeon as well. Like, we can't just do, like, the dungeon normally. You know, like a normal person. Might as well build the thing though while we're here. Inventing. We can actually make the thing if I hadn't sold my items. Disassemble invention. Okay, so we just destroy ship. Like, does this actually serve any purpose then? So this doesn't turn into a no, we need to disassemble. But how do I deter- how do I do that though? I don't understand how you do that. How you select what it goes for. Like, all I can think to do is just scrap it and hope that it does something. Oh, this has got a giant ass. This has got a 20, 20 day cooldown to it. Where's my scrolled notes? How many do I need? 15.
All right, we get to choose. Teacher schematic for just a low end engineering accessory. Teacher schematic for a pulsing pylon. And all of these sound useless. It's a tinker. No, this is what I needed. I want that professional gear. I'm probably just going to stockpile scrap. How many scrap do we rummage through? We'll just save like a bit of scrap. I guess we could just rummage through scrap and hope to learn something. Get some materials. I just don't understand what the fuck that's supposed to do. Why isn't it working? Oh, it can only be used outside, that's why. A tailoring tool. Like, those are the ones I care about, so... Speed bomb. Speed! I still don't fucking understand how the fuck that thing works though, but oh well. Why the fuck would you need cook in? Why the fuck would you need cooking? And you can just put down a campfire. Well, let's do some dungeon. <laughs> then do it on normal. 
Don't be stupid. The edicts are my like The rookery is for whelps only. This. Before us stands the Storm Perch, Outlander. It is the command center and rookery for all Storm Riders. This is highly irregular. Why are these Storm Rooks tethered here? Thank the Titans you are here. The Storm Perch has been breached and the Storm Riders corrupted. Hurry! If we free these storm rooks, we can fly to and try to end this madness. Outlander, with me. Dude, they are dealing a lot of damage. Coratite! What are you doing? I'm out of range. Stop this! Is this the first boss? What is that orb? It's radiating dark energy and it's Disc. affecting the storm rocks. Let's kill everyone though. Let's go gambling. Because we deal so much fucking damage. I need to target something first. Oh, we deal so much damage because everyone's scaled to my level. But so is the enemies, though. What dark magic is this? How dare they defile their own storm rooks? Where is everyone? I can't fight this alone. <coughs> Gorin, what have you done? You've ruined everything. I left Gorin, my second, in it's charge of the me. storm perch when I left to investigate your Dalaran's crash. What has that traitor allowed to happen in my absence? I need a target. It's not my fault if you decide to pull fucking crack for no reason. Why is this thing not taking damage? Ah, oh, just don't get hit by SUPER LASER PISS! You 
deserved a better rider than Gorin. I will deactivate Gorin myself for this sacrilege. Yeah, but how do we get down? Do we just jump in the middle? Is that fine? Finally, I thought I'd have to fight Gorin on my own. Come, Outlander. We Come. will press forward and rescue who we can. my boomerang Take you to safety. Where boomerang? Oh. 
May the memory forever be cursed by what you have wrought here. Dark magic that was emanating from the Storm Riders is more powerful here. But how do I get down there? Uh, is that rope? Mm -hmm. Oh, we don't go down, or do we? How many bosses are in this place? How do we get down there then? Like, what the fuck's down the pit? Wait, no, this is, the pit was the right way to go. Do I just jump down the pit? Is there water at the bottom? Like, you're gonna die though if we jump down there, aren't we? No, there is water, I think. How do we get out of the water though? Oh, the ramp itself is probably how we get out of the water. I should just use all my scrap, like, it isn't that hard to get scrap, especially it seems that, um... Like, it seems that... Um... It seems to have elites drop more scrap. Like, I think in this run alone... I should pull as much... As we can. Take out the creatures channeling on that core. Oh wait, I can only use it in certain parts. Maybe I can't use it while in combat. There it is. Oh, it takes too long for him to come down. that gun deal. Just stuns, that's annoying. <laughs> Got a 24 hour cast time and only stun. Explosion. No matter. We must destroy it. I have seen nothing like it. Its energies have twisted them, changing them into this. You just like me for real. How 
How do we stop him being defensive like that? I hate shields. Spread out, guys. The rookery is for whelps only. Damn, zero loot as well. Let us return to the council. I must report to them. The entire order of the storm riders. We can prevent protect Dorangul no longer. Let us return to the council. <coughs> <clears throat> well, that was a weird dungeon. We're gonna finish this zone, like, we're so close to being finished. The Nerubians to a burrow near the Metery. They must be after the Cinderbrew. And without the Storm Riders. Do you have an appointment? The entire rookery, I see. At least the source is destroyed. I lament the loss of so many Storm Riders, but if the corruption had spread to Dorangul. We must talk later. With my storm riders inactive, Dorangul is undefended, save a handful of lay, um, lay peacekeepers. If the Nerubian attack here again, Dorangul will fall, and all of us with it. It is imperative that we draw them away from the city and take out the commander. We can and will make our own web and capture uh, Xerox in it. I have a plane. We are the bedrock. We are are the foundation. We can't trust the Nerubians will keep away from the Corway once it's repaired. We must strike at, um, at their forces before they can um, muster another assault. What is your plan? Conversation terminate. They want the Cinder Brew? I propose we let them have it, and then ignite it. Uh, now, now hold on! That will reduce my metery to rubble! I will see to its repair, Wenbrand. You have my word. Uh, ah, fine. But if my stock is involved, then so am I. Excellent. Then we are aligned. I follow the count. Then it's settled. We'll make our last stand at the Cinder um, Cinder Brewery. Fly high. Strike. Your archer friend is right. We must eliminate um, Xerox and his forces if the Corway is to remain safe. Let us head to the Cinder Brewery at once. Be vigilant. On your signal, I'll lure the Nerubians to the metery. And we will prepare a welcome for our guests. Let's just use all of our scrap. It only fills our bag with garbage. Sixty-nine scrap. I think you need to use a prototype first and then use this. Oh, 
that's a good one. Ooh, bit of scrap. Are all these profession things just engineering? Yeah. So you can get stargazers on the inland, I thought they'd only be found in the coast. It says, oh yeah, the finesse is from our skill, not the equipment. But yeah, the profession tools are just confusing. Like, the fact that, like, trying to get, like, the new profession tools, you can easily just buy the old. Fucking abysmal. And this is the stupid thing, like, the professions used to be fucking simple, and then Blizzard made them complicated, because they can't just have the game be like, actually understandable. They've got to make things complicated for no fucking reason. I keep forgetting how to actually cast line. I'll probably sort out my bag as well once we get to the next area. Oh, we're doing another dungeon. <coughs> the edicts are my guide. Thank the Titans and Rubens have not made the move and taken the meter yet. May the Titans carve your path. With all the Cinderbrew kegs here, the meter will burn hotter than the forges if we ignite it. I summarize this is why uh wood burn kegs are made out of stout strong um iron wood. They do not break or catch fire easily. Luckily we can start um a reflection from the inside reaction from the inside if we lead a fuse into each of them. These ropes will work left or up, round. Should work in a pinch. I have work to do. Out of range. 
Honestly, not sure if it's faster than ladder or just get on a flying mount. Damn, forgot to grab one. Folks will fall by my eh, my hand. It is my directive and my May will. Look, you can blow up my life's work if you if the um if it is our only choice, but I will not put my workers in danger. This is was the path we chose eh, all chose, but I won't have them sacrifice themselves to a fire or a ruby for it. Tell them that I said that um they need to get out of here immediately. And if a single one of them get so much as a chip the council will have a lot of it to answer Follow for. No directives, but your own. Glimmer pool. Evacuate. I hope the meteor. Um, I hope there's a meteor to come back to. Well, that. That, um, that's exciting and terrifying. What path brought you don't have to tell me here? twice. I hope there's a meter to come back to. Tell the workers in the forest to keep away. I'll tell the workers in the forest to keep away. Nerubians here. You have to tell me twice. Speak freely. I'm glad no the, to, uh, to hear that they um they had the sense to clear out without much of a fuss. Commit our meeting to memory. The meadery is evacuated and explosives are primed. It is time to bait the Nerubians into our trap. Um your competitor is by competitor is by the Nerubian borough north of here. She told um me her directives is to keep watch over the case in case the new Ruby make the move before we are ready. So far they have not made a move and we um, are now in need of coasting. Take this keg of cinder brew uh, to the burrow, toss it in and it should stir the nest. Rendezvous is back at the meadery quick after. May let's set off the keg and hurry back to the mead yard. Then we will finish our preparations. I need to get closer. Suplex it like a boulder. You know what they say. They go, this bitch. Empty. Over here, champion. Let's burn some Nerubians to cinders. This bitch empty. Yeet. Return to the meadery. I'll lead them into the trap. You know what they say about traps, though. What is your the Rubian swarm is on the way. Prepare yourself. Fly high, strike true. Conversation in the Rubians will strike in, in anger and pride, which is exactly what we want. The swarm, they'll swarm the meadery soon, seeking to punish us for attacking their borough. We will hold them here on the ground while um, you take to the skies. When uh, Zurex appears to command his armies, we will light the fuses. When Ben scurred, um, scourge together some supply, scurry together some supplies we can use to corral the Nerubians. Set them up quickly, and then we can get um, on your, get you on the storm rook. The Nerubians will soon start swarming from the north. Place our defenses in their path. The honey will slow them down, and the mead and pollen will help us tear through them. Out of time. Come, 
Let us get you on a storm rook. I don't actually read what the things do. Do you require aid? The Rubians will swarm this place soon enough. Finish the preparations quickly. Be Prepare yourselves. They are coming. Uh, lightning ball. Uh, lightning when we all enemies nearby. Please burst static electricity. To any flying enemies. Past us. And from wrecking my metery before we do. Great, the fire doesn't seem to be doing anything. Great, we're doing an amazing job here. They'll go. They're chewing through the fuses. We still have two fuses left. Keep fighting. Keep drawing them in. Uh, why is it not hitting it? Well, this went absolutely fucking terribly. No, they severed all of the fuses. Stay focused. These monsters cannot leave here alive. Stop on the earth. You will not impede my ascension. Outlander, leave this to me. The fuses! We can't ignite the kegs! I must fulfill my edict. What? Forget the edicts! <coughs> I cannot. That is why it must be me. You must guide the Earthen. Belgrim! One last ride, then you are free. Xerix! My directive is to protect this isle and the earthen. All the earthen. <laughs> Glory to the Titans! Long live the earthen! Should have probably read the defenses better though. Because my defenses were garbage. Baelgrim. Oh, twisting paths. He's gone. We did it, but he's gone. Xerox is dead. We did it. It's over. Bering did it. She repeats the last part to herself over and over, quietly, each time as if unable to process the event. Forge your own. We defeat Defter de dealt a hefty blow to the Rubians, but Belgrim paused to compose herself. He was infuriated and rigid, and um, we argued constantly, but in the end he was a defender of our people, all of them. Belgrim sacrificed himself to vou um, vouchsafe the I Isle of Adorm from the Nerubians. Everyone needs to know that, and we can't uh, let the Nerubian force our hand like this again. Go to Maldrix and Dorangul. Tell him that will come soon. We just need a moment here. Converse. I... The Corway's repairs must continue. It's what Balegrim would have wanted. We'll do the metery next time. Electric charge. 
in ages. I see you return alone, Outlander. I presume not all went well. <sighs> With the help of the um, um admin workers, Ad Golan's workers, major repairs on the core and machinery are complete. The Titan <laughs> will in it will soon be fully functional again. Very well. You're alive, all but dismissed. what of the others? Must go. We heard an echo of an explosion from here. I presume that you found victory, but your sole arrival suggests not so well. What happened? The eternal titans sculpt you. Tell me what has happened. Count's award. We... We have bad news. The Unbound welcome all. Our people must know of uh, what Belgrim did for us. Heed the call. We have repelled the Nerubians, but Belgrim is gone. I see. So he fulfilled his edict. Not just that. He defended the Earthen, both the Oathsworn and the Unbound. More than anything, he wanted us to stand together again. United for Darlan. Then we will honor his memory by doing so. It will take time to fully repair the Corway, but the Outlanders can descend to the Ringing Deeps. The Earthen of the Isle of Dorn will support their endeavor. No matter what the edicts say. If we can bring the machine speakers back into the fold as well, then the council will truly stand complete. Thank you, Council Ward. Now, let's clear the last of that rubble. Clear Stormwind, it will be turned to rubble. We will find Zalatath. Do not be lulled into a false sense of victory, our cat. Zartaf yet lives. So long as she schemes in the shadows, the safety we secured here is fleeting, just as it was in Darlan. While Anduin and the Earth intend to the, are wounded, I will protect them the way I know best, by slaughtering all she who, um, dare attack you. Let us do it then. Oh, that was the tunnel, was it? Nope. You address the council with the hell oh, wait, we, were doing we have all learned of Bolgum's valor. He died to uh, preserve uh, our people, our unity. We must not let it be in vain. Conversation I will accompany you to the ringing deeps. It is my home, and it too may need defending. But yeah, that is the zone done. So we will head <coughs> into the depths next time. But I will sort out my bag so we have more bag space. So, see you next time.